Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Lisa Hanibati Muhammad Idris. My mission number is 152564. I'm a final student from School of Physics, University of Science, Malaysia. Assalamualaikum and hi. My name is Hawa Sabrina Bekin Bajani. My mission number is 152509. I am a final year student from School of Physics, University of Science, Malaysia. In this video, we will present to you the story of Mary Curie. I want to tell you about radium, a most peculiar and remarkable element because it does not behave as it should. Mary Skoliska, later known as Mary Curie, was born in Warsaw, Poland in 1867. Despite facing numerous challenges, including poverty and societal limitation for women, she was an uh, insatiable thirst for knowledge and determination to pursue her dream. Mary excelled in her study, demonstrating essential talent in physics and mathematics. Despite facing discrimination as a woman in a male-dominated academic world, she persevered, earning her master degree in physics and mathematics from the Sorbonne University in Paris. Then, and the Picurie, a fellow scientist and married future husband, together they become the ultimate scientific power couple, explore the uncharted territory of what may have served up radioactivity. The discovery of radioactivity by Henry Pecker in 1896 inspired the Curies in their brilliant uh, researches and analysis, which led to the isolation of polonium, named after the country of Mary Pert and Radium. Curie developed methods for the separation of radium from radioactivity residue uh, in sufficient quantities to allow for its characterization and the careful study of its property, therapeutic properties in particular. Curie throughout with her life actively promoted the use of radium to alleviate suffering and during World War I, uh, it is by her daughter Irene, she personally, personally devoted herself to this remedial work. Mary soon started her work to save life. Her discovery of radium and polonium were important because the elements were radioactive. She used her groundbreaking understanding of radioactivity to help the X-ray take stronger and more accurate picture inside the human body. In 1903, Mary Curie and her husband, P. Curie, were awarded the Nobel Prize in Physics for their groundbreaking work on radioactivity. Just four years later, Mary Curie received the Nobel Prize in Chemistry for her discovery of polonium and radium, becoming the first person to receive Nobel Prize just in two different scientific fields. Mary Curie worked on radioactivity, paved the way for the development of X-rays and radiography revolutionizing medical treatments for this cancer and other diseases. Her discovery also had profound implications for our understanding of atomic structure and the universe as a whole. Physicist and chemist Mary Curie was a pioneer for women in science. She broke down barriers and brought new ideas to life. In her personal life, Curie did not allow social and beauty standards to hinder her self-confidence or commitment to work. Sarah, a history and tourist, found himself researching Mary Curie in 2017, the 150th anniversary of her birth, shared that when Curie got married, she requested a plain dark gown so that she could reuse it and wear it in lab. Much of her work in a small shed, exposing herself in extended period to radiation as she works on her study, but finding it all worth it as she made discovery and received PhD on researches on radioactive substance in 1903. Throughout her career and time working in shed, Curie discovered radium, polonium, and radioactivity, even coining the term of radioactivity.